Hello, hello! Human Human 2 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Digimon Survive, and we are on part 19, I think. I think. Pretty sure. Rio lost it. He's officially gone over the edge. He is on a bridge. I don't know what's gonna happen. I feel like this might be a make it or break it moment for his character, and I'm really worried I'm gonna break it. <laughs> Mommy's here, I'm going to see my mommy. Mama. Mommy, mommy, it's me. He he help me. No! You idiot! Oh, you poor little boy. You want to see your mommy that badly? Then come right over here, you poor baby. You're you're a fake. You're not my mommy. You betrayed me. Mommy would never betray me. Never. She'd be there to save me no matter what. Don't you see me? I'm going to meet my mommy. You got that? Mommy, save me. Have you lost your mind completely? Shut up! I'm not talking to you! I'm talking to Mommy! Get lost! Mommy, I've tried so hard for so long. I've been wanting to see you so badly. Come get me, Mama. Come quickly. What a shame. I do believe this child is broken. Now what to do with him? Suppose I ought to perform the ritual and offer him as a sacrifice. But that would make him a part of this world. I suppose he'll just have to die. Cyclomon, come here, would you? Yes, Lady Arukerimon. Kill this boy for me, would you? Should be easy enough. I'll leave it to you. Yes, my lady. Very good. I shall return to the altar then. He's yours. I will kill the boy. What the, what's going on? Mommy? Stay still. You're so hard to hold. I'll drop you for him here. That'll kill you for sure. Help me, Mommy. Shut up. Oh! Ah, uh, save me, mommy, stupid boy. Time to end you. Rio! What is that thing? A huge one eyed monster? That is Cyclomon, a brute concerned only with his own power. Don't let the size of him scare you, he's a total buffoon. Is Rio still alright? He's trying to resist, he's still okay. Then we need to save him fast. I'm scared, but I'll do my best. He says he wants us to save Ryo. We're on it. Don't worry, Mar Don't worry, Kudamon. Stay back. This could be dangerous. Okay. Okay. I love that they throw their, their dukes up like they're going to do something. Florimon has to be a part of this? Really? Okay. Well, I'm putting Kudamon in here. It only makes sense. A little disappointed that Kudamon wasn't automatically in there. Um, you know, we were having a lot of issues with healing last time, so I'm going now. I'm going to throw Lotmon in here. This is probably not a great combination, but I'm going to do it and see what happens. Do your best. I shot at them. Love it. All right. I'm gonna go ahead and digivolve. Actually, I'm gonna save it just because I know that he's my only Digimon that can digivolve in this group. So I'm gonna need him to do that. That like pushes him back too. Oh, I wish you could move more, buddy. Damn, Lamon has a surprising amount of movement. Let's break this open. I really should have put Labramon in here. I'm a little mad at myself for that, but whatever. We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna get this done. So they're gonna be the more aggressive ones, huh? Ha!
It's good amount of gonna get to Digimon. Oh, no Saki is. You're right, Floramon. Puny little. You. Me. You're holding back. You only pretend to fight hard. No. You do not care about this one, so you pretend. Get lost. You are a nuisance. No, I... I... Keep it together! Do I, do I really not want to save Ryo? Am I holding the others back? I don't know, I just don't know. Don't let him get to you. I know better than anyone how much you care. Do you really not want to save one of your friends? I don't know, I just don't know anymore. I did it because it was the good thing to do. I didn't want the others to hate me. Did I really care about Ryo's feelings? I don't know. What was I supposed to do? Florima? You have an amazing heart. Just do what it tells you. That's all you need to do. But my heart tells me... Ask yourself, Saki, is it telling you to stop right now? It's not. It's or it's not telling me to stop. One of my friends is suffering right in front of me, and I am not about to just sit here and watch. Florimon, lend me your strength. That's the way. I This would have been a better place for Kunamon to digivolve. Florimon? Who do we get for Florimon? I'm kind of curious. Vegemon? Vegemon, I don't... I don't care for Vegemon as Florimon's champion. I'm gonna be real. I honestly would have preferred Togemon. I know that would have been... Strength Eager, make sure that we'll be able to Vegemon. Now my strength matches what's in your heart. All right, here we go. I hope you're ready for this, Cyclops Mon. I don't, I don't like Vegemon at all. I actually really don't like Vegemon as a Digimon. Like no T no shade. Not a fan personally. You know what? Let's go. We're just gonna go fight this guy right now. Let's Digivolve. Let's do it. Let's go. Okay. He is not doing well. Can we not kill him? Cut it out. Cyclonemon's super strong. We can't let that stop us. We've got to save Ryo. Come on, Agumon. Keep it up. Right. Attack shook the whole bridge. Uh. Oh no. He dived into the water after him? No way, they fell off the bridge. Haru. We've got to go save them. Time to wrap this up now. Right. <laughs> yeah, Vegemon is the only champion. A little disappointed, but it's fine. Um, what is the attack of these? I'm not gonna get to see it. Poop Toss. What a terrible champion for Floramon. That doesn't match Saki at all, in my opinion. That's just me. I just don't I just don't like it. Although I also don't feel like Labramon. I don't know. I don't I like some of the Digivolutions. Because I do like that they're generally different from the usual line, but I definitely feel like. I feel like Kiwimon would have made more sense for Floramon, right? I just want to know. Ew, yeah, Vegemon is her champion. That's like it. Kiwimon would have made more... Well, not if they weren't going for a bird one, I guess. That makes more sense. But I feel like there's other champion-level plant Digimon they could have gone with. 
Woodmon would have even been. It would have been at least more in line. Not more in line, but... If they wanted to go with something that wasn't necessarily like a good Floramon one... I don't know. That was rude. Damn, okay. You're just getting your ass beat right now, homie. We're gonna do this one more time. Dead. A real fell off a bridge. I need people to stop falling off of bridges and structures. I just hate how uninterested a good chunk of the kids are in their partners. Not chunk, it's really just two of them. All right, that monster dropped me and I died. Wait, no, I'm alive, but how? I was up so high. Jesus Christ. Oh, it's just you. Don't scare me like that, you miserable little brat. That's the thanks I get for saving you. Save me. Don't be ridiculous. Whatever. Not that I care about you anyway. I don't take that from some little brat. What's wrong with you? Don't look at me like that. Like I said, I don't care about you. Not at all. Probably shouldn't try to move. You may not have died, but you were injured. That's right, I've got my phone. I can call mommy. That's not working. I can't call my mom. Jesus, Rio is a mess. Why do you want to return to the real world? I don't belong here. This isn't my world. To me, the others all hate me. I know because they all treat me like dead weight. They're trying to use those monsters of theirs to get rid of me. Oh, is that how it looks to you? I'm gonna go back, back to my world, back to my home. It's okay, and even now, mommy will call me and then I'll be saved. Just how long are you going to keep deluding yourself? You should know better than anyone that your monster is, your mother is never going to call you. That's right. Mommy was always sick. I wanted to spend more time with her, but the doctor said no. I cried so hard whenever I was lonely. She told me to be strong, but, but those, those were her last words. Mommy's dead. Of course she's not going to call. Of course not. Now I get it. Now it all makes sense. I've died in this the afterlife, which means mommy must be somewhere close by. Can somebody beat his ass? That's it, isn't it? You're here, aren't you, mommy? Oh, please come get me. This kid is done for. He's completely snapped. There you are. But I'm afraid you're too late. I think I see something. Something in the fog. You can see for yourself. Your precious Rio has lost all touch with reality. Don't you? Okay, wait for me, mommy. I'll be right there. Jesus, Rio. I found them. They're both okay. Haru. What a relief. Your face is a mess from all those tears. So glad we found them, though. The fog is starting to spread. Uh, call me crazy, but is Rio running into the fog? Doesn't sound like he's doing too well. I thought I heard him laughing. This is not looking good. The fog is getting real dense. Right, this is bad. Rio, Haru, quick! Or you're both in danger. Get over here, quick! What's that? Looks like some sort of tentacle came out of that shadow. Man, that thing looks like real bad news. Rio's in trouble to be helped. It's risky, but yeah. You expect me to just leave him? You're not gonna make it, the fog will get you too, but no. <laughs> I finally got to see you again, mommy. And now we'll we'll always be together. Please don't leave me again. What? Dumbass.
Oh! That's horrible. Rio has to still be there, right? No. What, Miyuki? Shaking her head like that, is she telling me I should give up? Takuma, Haru. What happened to Rio was he gave up on himself. So this world consumed him. Even after the fog lifted and the shadow vanished, there was still no sign of Rio. Not really sure what Haru meant by what he told me, but I do know one thing's for certain. Rio is gone? Oh, Rio is dead. Can you? No, I know he can. I know he can live. Because I know I've seen promotional like footage of Kunamon digivolving. After all that, Shuji eventually got us to calm down and we returned to the school. Leave it to Shuji to step up in a situation like that and get us all back safety. Safely. Kaido, Kaido was next to recover. He was all ready to go to the amusement park and find Ryo, Miyu. But the rest of us managed to convince him to come back to the school instead. Shuji made the case that we could search more effectively after we'd, re after we'd regrouped. And after seeing what happened to Ryo, even Kaido must have realized the need for caution. I don't feel as bad. Ryo has to die. Um, apparently you can save him, but only in like a new game plus. So it's like a like a secondary storyline kind of thing. Jesus. Everyone else was pretty upset and shaken from having witnessed Rio's death. It was dark by the time we got back and we were exhausted. Nobody bothered with dinner. Well, the others mostly seemed to collapse into sleep, though I found that impossible. My mind kept coming back to the same thought. Surely there must have been something more I could have done. Maybe if we'd all worked together, or if I'd been more determined, or... Cooperation. Maybe if we'd all found a way to communicate and work together, we could have saved him. No, it wouldn't have mattered. Even if we'd be able to do something, Agumon and the others were frozen with fear. It's starting to get cold. If I stay like this, I'll probably end up getting sick. Even if I can't sleep, maybe I should just lie down for a while. Well, shit. Rio is super dead. I was not expecting that. I now I know they can die, apparently. Takuma. Aw. You alright? You seem kinda out of it. I've been thinking about Ryo. Okay. Oh. There must have been something we could have done to save him. Maybe if we started earlier. I knew. When he couldn't up to Kunamon, when he got so scared of Dokugumon. How he acted in that classroom on the trail, or even just talking with him, it was clear. I knew we were struggling, but I didn't help him. I just let him suffer. What do you think might have changed things, Takuma? He'd talk with us. You know, I wish Ryo to talk more with the rest of us. That way he wouldn't have felt so alone. He would have found a place with us. It's not like I've got all the answers. Who knows if what I did was right or what I should have done differently. Not me, that's for sure. I can tell that you're hurting. You're right, Agumon. I hurt so much. That's And what's worse is that even after losing Ryo, there's no clear way out of this. Aru Kenimon is still after us, and maybe that amusement park is crawling with enemies. Plus, if we have been transported to some other world, is there even a way back? I don't know. I just don't know. What are we even supposed to do? Takuma. Listen, I may not know much, but I do know one very important thing. And it's that if you try Takuma, you can do anything. Whether you team up with the others or just blindly press on in the end, you'll succeed. Where's this coming from? I'm not that special. But you are Takuma. I know it. And I believe in you. Agumon. That actually makes me feel better. Maybe now I'll be able to get some sleep. 
Then I'm glad. Good night, Agumon. I'm depressed. This is... Wow. I did find the human children, but you see, my servants all proved so incompetent. Is this Piedmon? I feel like it's Piedmon from the ribbons. I don't know. Next time I'll get them for sure. I'll capture all those human children and offer them up to our master without fail. The altar was prepared. Did you not perform a sacrifice? Have you not only let the children escape, but also failed to provide an offering? Actually, that wasn't me. Someone must have beaten me to the punch. Yet yeah, you did not confirm who this was, or if indeed they made the sacrifice. I did not, but several children still remain. Next time they won't be so lucky. You're not up to this task on your own. I could always have Mega Sijermon help you. No doubt he would be similarly motivated to prove his devotion to our master. I'm quite up to the task. Children Ox gave me a second time. You'll see. Out of my way. Dear me, how crass. Tell me, Garuruman, what brings an outsider like yourself to speak with us? I heard those traitors who got strong by teaming up with the humans have turned on us. And what of it? Just what I've been waiting for. I'm gonna crush them all. As if brute force will help you accomplish anything. You're such an idiot. What are you still? What are you? Still up to your old tricks? Refusing to fight your own battles? Ha. Huh. Spoken like a true simpleton. Only a fool would insist in fighting their battles. You make me sick, every last one of you. Enough of this. She started it. This gets us nowhere, and I see no need for a cooperation. Do what you wish. As if I'd ever do anything else so long. What a surprise. He shows up, picks a fight, and leaves. Are you sure we can trust him? His skills are undeniable, and he holds a grudge against human children, that's clear. More importantly, heed my words, Arukenimon. Our master will not tolerate any more failure. I am well, well aware of that. Who do you take me for? So long as you know, there will be no more second chances. Not just Monsema and Mega Sidramon here. There are countless others who could take your place. I'm thinking Piedmon or maybe I'm trying to think of anybody else who would have those ribbons. Pinocchio. I'm thinking of like Dark Masters. I don't think Pinocchimon. He I think he's you would they would see his stuff. I don't know. I don't know. Could be a reference to Mummy Mon, that'd be interesting. How could those little brats do this to me? <laughs> well, all right then. They can just wait and see. Okay, you a bad bitch. I get it. Okay. Okay. No, not that way, Rio. Come back. Rio, Rio. Rio, Rio! So I had a nightmare. Just because I saw my friend get ripped to shreds by fog monsters. I woke up from a nightmare this morning, drenched in sweat, palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy. My head's still shaking. It's not surprising. I had a lot on my mind last night and sleep did not come easy. Not after watching Rio die right in front of us yesterday. But beyond the terror of watching someone die for the first time, seeing that strange tentacle reach out and grab him was just awful. Just thinking back on it sends a shiver down my spine. But I shouldn't let myself dwell on it. Not after how Agumon cheered me up last night. Wait, where is Agumon? Everyone else for that matter. They're all thriving because Rio's gone! All the negative energy's gone. Shuji and Lotmon are like picking daisies together. Best friends. Am I the last one up? Then all the more reason to get moving. We need to figure out what comes next. It's not too late, so maybe the others are still in the cafeteria. I better go see. Oh, good morning, Kaido. Drakmon. Finally up, are you? 
Seems pretty mad. Has he been waiting for me to wake up this whole time? Sorry, I woke up so late I had a hard time getting to sleep. I'm sure you were exhausted. Or should I know? You're the only one who's shown up. Thought for sure they'd all be in here. Where's everybody? All over the place, apparently. I'm looking pretty upset. They did see that friend of yours get taken to the fog right in front of them. Bishad's bothering all of them as much as it is you. It's a good point. Ryo's death didn't just come as a shock to me. It has to be on everyone's mind. They'll need to process what happened. We should probably give them some time. We don't have any time to give. We need to get out there and save Mio. With that strange fog, everyone's nervous. All the more reason we should move fast. Mio is in trouble. It's not just the fog. There are monsters after her. That's right, Aru Kenimon, that spider monster, said something about a sacrifice. She was really strong, too. There are lots of other things like her out there. This is why I wanted to find Miu yesterday. Should never have let you talk me out of it. No, I never should have taken my eyes off her in the first place. This is Takuma. My sister's life is online. I love Drachmon in this game! Getting mad isn't going to help anything. You know what's going to help? Arguing while we while waiting for help that's not coming. I'm going to go look for Mio on my own. I don't wait. It's too dangerous for you to go by yourself. We all need to stick together. I agree. I don't want you putting yourself in danger. Drachmon. Alright, fine. That's a relief. We managed to get through to him for once. But I'm only waiting around until noon. After that, I'm going. What? I'll wait here till noon. Then I'm looking for Mio no matter what anyone says. I'll go alone if I have to. You'd be such an idiot sometimes. You know I'll be with you if it comes to that. Hey, who are you calling an idiot? You obviously. Who else would I be talking about? Probably got some stupid idea about not putting anyone else in danger, don't you? Quit trying to do everything by yourself. What do you think I'm here for? You really feel that way? Alright, sorry about that. Drachmon seems genuinely concerned for Kaido, and Kaido does actually seem to listen to Drachmon in his own way. Might not look like it, but I think those two are actually pretty close. So Takuma, guess this means you better round everyone up. I'll need to keep an eye on Kaido to make sure he doesn't take off early. Got it, I'll go get the others. Let's see if I've got until noon. Oh no, that's hardly any time. I need to get everyone here quick. Free action. All right, so I have 11 moves. That's plenty of moves. I don't even know where Shuji is. I'm gonna say Shuji is not there. <sighs> All right, well, I think I'm going to leave it off here. Um, but when we come back, we will go ahead and start rounding up all the troops. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you enjoyed today's video, please subscribe, like, and or comment. Also, feel free to check out my TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram, which are all linked in the description below. Beneath that, you will find a link invite to the Discord channel. Um, so feel free to hop on in and join the community. And yeah, I think that really covers everything. Thanks so much for watching, everybody, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye! Rio is dead. I know I joked that I wanted Ryo to die, but I was not ready for that. That was a whole... Wow. Wow.